Hey guys, Brian here, and uh, I am doing a video, an unusual video for me. I don't really do much, many videos about my life, uh, you know, non-pagan life, I guess, if there's such a thing. But I got a video request for this, and I thought this would be a very fun video. And it's about my animals, and they're always trying to make an appearance in my videos, so I thought I should uh, honor that their request and and give them some screen time so i'll just uh go one by one i'll track them down and uh so i'll start off with this one since she's already here this is atticus the cat and despite her name she is a she uh and she is just an absolute fuzzball she is so soft She's so playful, she loves people, she loves attention. And as you will see in the video, not all not all of our cats are like that. She's very pretty, isn't she? Yes, she is. Um Atticus the cat. She, she loves playing with the dog. She thinks she's a dog. I I'm pretty convinced that she thinks she's a dog. She'll chase after his ball whenever we throw it for him. And she'll just try and you know, she'll bat at him when he walks past playfully and she'll you know run around and she's she's so soft uh what does she like besides playing and being a dog she loves sneaking into doors when we open them for rooms that she's not supposed to be in so like the bedroom my wife's studio the basement thankfully she doesn't try to run outside our cats are indoor cats so it's a little crowded, but she loves sneaking into my wife's studio. Uh, and it's hilarious. Uh, what else does she like? What she doesn't like, she doesn't like cat treats for some reason. She hates, she just she turns her nose up to them. I don't know what that, what the deal with that is, but, but she loves getting petted. She's so soft. Okay, so I'll find my other cats. Thank you, Atticus. So this is Aster. She is a gray cat, and she is the opposite of Atticus. She hates everyone except for me and my wife. Oh, look at that. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> That's classic Aster. Uh, she loves food. She loves food of any kind. Uh, corn checks. Popcorn. She's always walking under my feet when I'm in the kitchen preparing something, thinking she's gonna find some. Um, when I first when I first met Aster, she hated me, but she quickly grew to love me. She, she's obsessed with me. Um, she loves sitting in my lap, and she loves meowing really loud if she can't sit in my lap. And she will race me into the bathroom. Uh, which can kind of get a little annoying. She likes licking my arm. Uh, she's just such a goofball sometimes. She's just a derpy, a derpy kitty. She hates, she hates people. She absolutely hates people except for me. Um, she goes by Aster. She also goes by Pudge Grumps because she's so grumpy. Uh, all our animals have like multiple names. Yeah, she hates Atticus, and she's she's okay with the other one. Sometimes they cuddle and snuggle, and sometimes she's just like, "Leave me alone! I hate everyone." Um, she uh, she absolutely hates the dog. When we first got the dog, she hid under the couch for like two days, uh, which you know she got over it. This is Sedge. He's antisocial, and I'll try to get him out though. This is Sedge, our only male cat. He's he's very pretty, isn't he? He's, he's all white. And he's just so regal all the time. Um, he doesn't really. He's pretty indifferent when it comes to people. Um, he's just a. I had to coax him out from under the couch with treats. He Now he's not even really... There he goes. So that was Sedge. Um, he keeps to himself. Sometimes you'll 
you know, hang out with the other cats, play. But as you could see, he wants to hide under the couch and sleep. And this is Finnegan, the only dog in the house. And he thinks he's convinced he needs something on off the desk. Um, Finnegan, he's a good boy. Um, he his hair is usually way longer, and he look usually looks like a mop, but he just got groomed not too long ago, so he's all short haired. He is a, a hilarious dog. Um, you know, just like any any dog or animal, he's full of you know his own little characteristics and little quirks. Uh, he goes by many, many nicknames. Finnegan, Finny, Fin Fin, Finny Foofs, Tutter Guts. Um, I don't know where most of these come from. He loves convincing us that it's time to go outside or to play when we're eating. But we realized that he actually doesn't need to go outside when he's barking and whining at us when we eat he just wants to bark and whine at us when we eat because we've eaten outside before and he does the same thing uh so i don't really understand that uh he likes playing but only if he doesn't like playing fetch he he'll only he'll get the ball and not bring it back won't you yeah um he likes playing tug of war he likes barking at everyone he hates men with a passion, <laughs> don't you think? <laughs> you look so cute. Um, you, you do. He hates men with a passion. Anyone like middle-aged men with like gray hair, he just hates. So he hates our neighbor with a passion. He's the arch nemesis of Finnegan. Um, he we uh we pet sit for a family, and they have three or four dogs four or five dogs now uh and his best friend whoop, his best friend is a three-legged pit bull great dane mix uh white and named wilson wilson is hilarious and they get along so well they just play together and he's actually going to stay with stay with wilson and his family uh over the next what week while we're gone at caldera fest so he's going to love that. Don't you? You are you, you love your friends. Don't you think again? And he loves licking our faces. And now Atticus is right here trying to get in. Get in on all this digital video love. So yeah, I hope that, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I hope that fulfills the, the animal, I don't know. So I hope, I, I hope that video, this, I, <laughs> okay, and action. I hope this video, uh, covered my animals, uh, well. Uh, I hope you learned a lot and odd and ooed at the animals as cute as they are and yeah if I'm if I missed anything about my animals let me know I'm not exactly 100% sure what I should say about my animals they're part of my family um, the cats are a little more independent <laughs> but yeah uh, thanks for watching it's, it's almost your turn don't worry